an entertainment 8x10 return. What? <laughs> and some more for the set coming up. Hello again, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me as always. My name is Troy Rudder, aka TTM Troy, and I am so glad that you're here with me today. For, I want to say a couple months, I've been teasing that I had this entertainment return, and what happens is it, it, it's not with all of my other returns, and so I can kind of keep forgetting it, but today is the day I'm going to fill you in on that, as well as a couple of cards for the set. Hopefully you guys have had a great week so far. You know, we had President's Day on Monday, and so there was no mail, but some people have been catching up. I think I had three TTMs on Tuesday. But uh, nothing from spring training yet. So hopefully you guys have been getting something from spring training already. If you have, leave a comment down below and tell me who you have gotten for spring training this year. Now, a lot of people are returning cards that were sent to them last year. But I'm kind of interested to see who is signing so far this year. So there you go. If, if you've gotten something back so far this year that you've sent this year, go ahead and put it down below. But let's get right into the TTMs, and we can talk about spring training in a little bit. So here is that entertainment TTM that I've been promising you, coming up right now. Boom. All right, we have Micah Borum. She signed one of one in 1,156 days. The funny thing about this return is her P.O. box is actually two doors down from my P.O. box in California. Um, let's see. She was recently uh, in a movie called Hollywood.con, where she was uh, the producer, I believe. And uh, she's been in uh, Dawson's Creek as Harley. She was in Touched by an Angel. Along Came a Spider. She was in The Patriot. She was in the movie Jack Frost. Uh, not the horror version, but the <laughs> kind of the family movie one with Michael Keaton. And she's just done a lot of different things. So I had written to her and then she sent me this 8x10 that you see here. As well as, I didn't scan this, but a little... That's going to throw my white balance off incredibly. But she wrote a little thing on here for Hollywood.com. Uh, wishing you the best of luck. Sounds like you are a hard worker who comes from a strong family. Cheers. And then her address down below. So... Over 1,100 days from Ms. Micah Borum. Next, we have Joey Wendell. This is a return from last year that I had sent to the Rays pretty late in the season. So, again, this is not from spring training. So, just, I'm going to say that again. This is not from spring training. This is from last year that I sent to him, okay? Now, he's played from the A's from uh, uh, February 16th of 2017 and then he went to the Rays from 2018 to the present. Joey made his debut on August 31st, 2016 and then <laughs> uh, at one time he got hit by a pitch and fractured his wrist. I think that was actually last year and he ended last year's season with a batting average of .276 with 12 home runs and 96 RBIs. Joey Wendell. Next we have Bill Hasselman. He actually signed uh, one of one in 565 days via his home in Washington. You can find that address on Star Tiger. Now, if you are new to the channel, you probably uh, need to know that if I cannot find a public address for a celebrity or a sports figure, I do direct you to the site that I got the address from, which in this case is Star Tiger. You can find that right there. But then he also signed one of one in 37 days. So 567 days and 37 days. So I only needed one for the set. So one of these might be going off to a couple of the other, or one of the other people on uh, Instagram who are working on this set as well. So he played from 1990 to 2003 for the Rangers, the Mariners, the Red Sox, the Tigers, and then a couple more times for the Rangers and the White Red Sox again. Then he went on to coach for the Red Sox, and he's also been involved in various other jobs in the minors. So very cool to get uh, two back from Mr. Hasselman. Looks like they're signed with the same pen, uh, one with 567 days and then one in 37 days. Next, we have Joel Skinner. He signed one of one 
and another one of one. So he signed one in 568 days and another one in 467 days via the Rochester Red Wings. And I actually already have him. So again, these are kind of the duplicate cards right there. Uh, so he played from 1983 to 1991 for the White Sox, the Yankees, the Indians, and was actual, actually the manager of the Indians in 2002. And during his career, he replaced Carlton Fisk as a catcher. And then they kind of switched him around to different positions and this, that, and the other thing. And more recently, he was the manager of the Red Wings, which is the Triple A affiliate of the Twins. So very cool to get Mr. Joel Skinner twice. And uh, even though I already have him, one of them's one of them came bent. So uh, yeah, that's just gonna go in the connection collection. Next we have for the set Dave Rigetti. He signed one one in forty six days via the Giants. This came back late in two thousand and nineteen. He played from nineteen seventy nine to nineteen ninety five for the Yankees and the Giants. Also the A's, the Blue Jays, and the White Sox. He's a two-times All-Star, a three-times World Series champion, American League Rookie of the Year, two times the Roll Aids Relief Man, and also had a no-hitter on July 4th, 1983. He ended his career with an 82-79 win-loss record and a 3.46 ERA. Dave Rigetti for the set. I hope you enjoyed those TTMs. You know we have a a few that I have gotten before. Got an entertainment TTM and then a three times all star. Can't really go wrong with a three times all star. Dave Rigetti, I salute you. I think I already had him on one of his other cards. And so this was one that I did not have. So I will be adding that to my website, TTM Autograph. If you go there, you can go up to 1991 Don Russ, pull that down and see how I am doing on that set. It's getting kind of harder and harder. And I actually just bought uh, some slabbage of, uh, well, I'll show that in another video, but a, a Dodgers, some Dodgers slabbage. Let's see if people can figure out who it is. Boop. Nope. Let's see it again. Boop. Huh? <laughs> some of you are disqualified because I already told you about it, but there you go. I just like going boop, boop. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed that. You know, spring training is in full swing. See what I did there? <laughs> and uh, uh, there's been some questions whether you can still send us spring training. I'm like, absolutely. You still got a few more weeks that you can send to spring training. I don't know when the cutoff, uh, my usual cutoff is. I haven't even thought about that, to be honest with you. So uh, I sent out maybe 75. I didn't do as much as I wanted to, mainly because, you know, so I made a video, the last video that I did with the TTM supplies and everything, I talked about how I, I use the kiosk at the post office for a lot of my stamps. And I, I tell you, eight out of 10 times, the thing does not work. And that was the case uh, this past week. I went in, I was like, okay, I'm going to get some more stamps. It was on a Sunday and nothing. Instead of a boop, it was a wah, wah, no stamps whatsoever. And I could have gotten to Sam's Club, but I didn't. I came home and uh, I think I worked on the TTM website uh, instead, which is I don't know, maybe more fun. I don't know. But hopefully you guys have started to get some spring training stuff in. I have not, but I have been watching Instagram. I think I mentioned this in the beginning. I've been watching Instagram and people are getting stuff in and I can't wait to get some, some, uh, at least my very first one. I'll probably throw a party <laughs> when that happens. Um, I did send a Max Muncy who I have never sent to. Um, I sent to a few people that I had never sent to just because they were on my top TTM hot list of last year. And to answer the question that some people uh, have been asking me, I do not know if I'm going to be doing the hot list this year. It takes a lot of work, you know, to go through all the YouTube videos and all of the Instagram photos and forums and just try to find, uh, I tally up everybody who's signing and I look at every autograph and see whether they're signing in blue or black, if they put their jersey numbers, if they personalize, you know, it is a lot of work and um, yeah, I know people like it, but I, I'm still, I'm kind of on the fence whether it's going to have a 2020 uh, TTM hot list this year. We'll see. We'll see. 
But thank you. Whether or not I do the hot list, I want to thank you guys for watching this video on this Thursday. You know, I know um, even, man, my, my YouTube subscriptions are pretty full and I know what it takes to go through and watch a video. So all of you who have hit that uh, like button and the alarm button and get the notifications, I really appreciate that because the first few hours that a video goes up, you're like, oh, is, are people even gonna watch this? And you guys always come to, even the haters come through. Um, even the haters get notifications, it's awesome. And uh, side fact, even the haters help your YouTube algorithm show your video. Um, some people don't realize that, but it's true. So anyway guys, I am going to be gone this weekend, so I want to say thank you again. Hope you get some TTMs and mere mailboxes be full and your stamps forever. Bye-bye.